things needed for changing diapers of a bedridden patient disposable gloves a fresh adult diaper disposable mask waterproof pad like under sheet or under pad cotton roll or wet wipes if you use wipes choose mild ones ideally without fragrance or alcohol tub with warm water barrier cream to moisturize and protect the skin a disposable bag screen to maintain privacy before you start with the procedure of changing diaper wash and dry hands thoroughly put on disposable gloves and mask put the bed side screen or closed door to maintain privacy always inform the patient what you will be doing and seek his or her permission if possible adjust patient's bed to a comfortable height so that you can work easily if the patient is using a hospital type bed and the head is propped up then lower the head of the bed so that the patient is resting on his or her back raise the side rails on the opposite side to you and ensure that side rails on your side nearest to you are lowered place the patient in the center of the bed to keep the patient from falling out the bed cover the patient with a sheet expose only the perineal area in case patient is in coma or sedated or very heavy take help of another person to hold patient as required keep a waterproof pad or under sheet under the buttocks to prevent the bed from soiling taking off the soiled diaper unfasten straps or adhesive tape of the diaper and stick tapes to the diaper to avoid sticking on the elder's skin gently wipe the fecal matter or urine that may have adhered to the skin always wipe from the front to back in a direction away from the patient's private parts with your hand on the patient's hip and the other on his or her shoulder roll the patient away from you onto his or her side do seek patient's permission before changing the position if the patient is conscious and oriented in case patient is on a normal bed then use pillows to hold patient position and prevent patient falls in case the patient is unconscious take help of another person to hold the patient roll the used diaper inward to cover the soiled material slightly lift the patient's hip to pull the diaper towards you and out from under the hip roll up the soiled diaper into a tight coil using the adhesive tapes on the sides and dispose in the plastic disposable bag clean the buttocks area wipe from the buttocks to downward motion away from the patient's private parts pat dry the area and check for any signs of a developing bed sores gently roll the patient onto his or her back to clean thoroughly take disposable cotton and soak it in water squeeze the excess water and clean the patient's perineal area front and back as thoroughly as possible avoid pressing or rubbing the skin too hard place the used wipes or cotton in the disposable bag once you're done wash or sanitize your hands thoroughly gently apply a thin layer of barrier cream to the patient's perineum to moisturize and protect the skin putting on a new diaper put on disposable gloves and mask roll up one side of the new diaper and tuck it under patient's side gently holding the hip and the shoulder roll the patient towards you and then pull out the rolled up side of the diaper roll the patient onto his or her back pull up the front portion of the diaper from between the legs secure the diaper using the adhesive tapes on the sides of the diaper provided remove your disposable gloves and place them in the bag Place a new underpad beneath the patient if the sheet is soiled. Wash and dry your hands thoroughly. Aftercare. 
adjust the bed height and give him or her a comfortable position cover the patient properly with the sheet replace all the articles discard the water and rinse the tub with water and store it properly for next use record and report any observation to the nurse or doctor